Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome. It's time for more Cold War era mod. I'm your host, Kelvin, where our GDP is now fourth worldwide. We're about to overtake Japan and get third. Uh huh. Title of Empire, cool, cool. So, we're less than 500 prestige away from great power, which is good. And I've been kind of thinking. Anything? Question mark. Eh, whatever. Anyway. As I was saying, uh, I think it's about time. get something resembling an arm to our forces. I don't know what any meta would be for this, so I'm just gonna kinda, you know, take what we got here. Impact tactics and pillage Alright. But yeah, let's uh, start developing an armed forces. Would that be nice? And it will give employment to some people. We actually have almost no unemployed left. Which is pretty impressive, actually. Not really, I suppose, when you consider how many people have actually just left the country. Uh... Fossil fuels, I'm just going to start shutting these down. Alright, anywhere where the geothermal plants are doing too well build another set, you know? Alright. So yeah, we'll have the armed forces. Yeah, wow. Urban lower classes are slowly continuing to gain more. Gradually okay. turned down Tobago. Like, the next election will be a socialist victory. <laughs> it's as simple as that. I'm seriously being what to do about the peasants here. Well, there's not many of them. I gotta do some migration. I need to get the ability to accept people from outside. But, like, we're just stuck until the next election. And it sucks, man. It just sucks. Safety standards. Alright. So yeah, there's 
We managed to reduce a sizable number of the people in the uh, rural lower class. Yeah. Slowly but steadily shuttering these until eventually we're mostly just operating off of geothermal. You know, West Borneo. It's might not need much power here. I mean, there's kind of a limit to how much we can have, so it's not too bad. An agitator appeared, by the way. Oh, yes. An environmentalist agitator, fair enough. Alright, scientific management, nice. It's not really all that good, but oh well. Market wise, what do we need? We actually don't need much of anything, so that's really good. We're going to get more meat from uh, production upgrades soon. But otherwise, we're pushing just everything except processed food by the looks of it negatives. Which is great, really. Alright. Processed food factories everywhere. Alright. Infertile ground. Yeah, suddenly radicator. Mm -hmm. mm, they're the Liberal Party, have they? Alright, well, at this point it's the Liberal Party is yeah. It's we have the Conservative and the Socialists. The conservatives simply do not have clout to get things passed. But the uh, socialists do, so. Once they have their bonus. Well, like, we should have a fairly stable government after this election. Mm hmm. I wonder. Yeah, parliamentary supremacy would be good. Executive supremacy is great, but... Neat. Anyone? Nope. Yeah, I'd really like to go on a liberalizing spree. I'm hoping that as I spread, like things out, it'll get a little bit better. Like, I have a solid chance, yeah, because we got 56% in the House of Representatives, 61% in the Senate, that's actually really good. Kevin Mooney's only 50%, but yeah, because it's liberal controlled, still. It is in the state's interests to limit the spread of lies, yeah, let's knock them back a little bit. The Socialist Party has momentum. Mm -hmm. They can form. Uh, they can form a government. Should be good. Yeah. It's never really just kind of going to happen as uh, the rural lower classes lose number, because that's really where their support comes from. Like, the rural lower class, no matter how I want to swing it, is massive with 13 million people. Mm 
The bitter irony, of course, is that I, as I uh, do automation, we're going to end up with a lot less urban lower class as well. But that's fine. Yeah, I'm not too worried. Pesticides, GMO's fishing wharves, and livestock, nice. Alright, looks like they're kind of capped out. Yeah, we don't really have any unemployed anymore. Which is good. Else, uh, like that means somebody else actually became a superpower, right? Or, yeah, I don't know. Where do I see the ranks again? Stage. Uh, I'll mess up with this, maybe? Yeah, one, seven, six. Oof. Oh, oh yeah, you're no longer a superpower, that's what happened. There's no longer a communist superpower. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, now the USSR is kind of in the midst of its collapse, I guess. Yeah, Gorbachev is doing his thing. spreading. Nice. Alright. Yeah, our science rate is pretty high and actually climbing. Which is good. which seems absurd. Alright, market-wise, how are we doing? Not great. Well, looks like we need some roads. Um, how's power plants doing? Good. Good. Fuck that one, that's Sumatra. Kill those. Kill those. That. Okay. Not bad. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So representatives rearranged, yeah. There it is. Actually lose 14 legitimacy for this, but that's actually okay. Cause like we should then be able to like work more with these guys. Yeah. Wow. 
We are now a major reserve currency for 25% more minting. Yeah, that tracks. Like, not too bad. And overall, they throw a lot of class likes at the bit, so. I think it's a 54. Alright. We can get another company if I can find one that's profitable and not terrible. This is interesting. The problem is, West Drive Electrics gives me nothing of value. Yeah. All right. We'll establish uh, the gold combine of West Borneo. I mean, we definitely should. So. Mm -hmm. Trying to see if there's anywhere. This is the problem. Like I said, we actually don't really have any unemployed. Try to, but it's pretty difficult. Now, the good news is in Vortex, so about two years usually. Yeah, we'll get there. Slowly just switching over to uh, geothermal, which is nice. You know, it's good and environmentally friendly. Which, yeah, we're at 55% of a degree, 56-ish. Honestly, we're not doing too bad on the global warming front. So now that I have them in the government, 13, yeah. So that's actually pretty darn good. We'll be at 73. Mm -hmm. Strength penalty from sense of government, yeah. Just head of government, yeah. We'll keep that. Don't really have much else to do. I would like to like get a meritocratic cabinet and like deal with some of the problems here, but no one here really wants to. The only people who do, ironically enough, is the civil service. Like for the most part, because they're humanitarian, right? Maybe, maybe not. You know, let's see. Uh, yeah, one thing I can definitely do is go for parliamentary supremacy, which would be great. Another, you know, 10 government strength, including head of government. Fuck it. That gets us to 83. That gets us to the government. That's enough. You know, that is enough. You guys are really just building fuckloads of skyscrapers. What the hell's going on here? They do produce a lot. Real estate's valuable. Fair enough. Economy number three in the world. Mm -hmm. 
So Britain, you have 649 battalions, very well. Second Indonesian army. And finally. Second army's being built. Their force is barely getting anywhere, but that's yeah, fine. Yes. Oh, wow, containerization unlocked. Nice. Shame I don't even really need to upgrade the ports anymore. Yeah, we're just able to crank through these decks so good. Six worldwide education wise. We're doing well. We are doing well. Right, so, with any luck, it's only going to be a little bit longer. February 20th, 1986. Oh, no, that was the last checkpoint, sorry. December 24th, 1986. So, like. Come on, Christmas Eve. We can remove yet another vestige of our uh, dictatorial past. East Timor is independent. Unfortunately, no one wants to uh, be able to go to war right now. We'll see. Things might change. construct uh, our second army. Basic industrial robots, so same as me. Farm complexes. Okay. So, like, we're parodying uh, the US for development technologies. Yeah. Uh, our industry's caught up. Society and everything else, probably not, but. Mm. Some days it'd be like that. Exception number one worldwide, damn. Alright. So yeah, army number two is done well. Not too bad. Not too bad. Ah, uh, no trade rats created. Is it just military gear? Yeah. Let's clean up some of these inactive ones. I mean, I would like to be producing some of this locally. I mean, by some I mean all.
I wonder. Biggest rice farm. Maybe four? Looks like that might be it. Yeah, Central Java's got the uh, biggest rice farm, so I should have the uh, easiest time getting some of this through. Once uh, the you know, farm tech or whatever comes out, we should be good. So yeah, this one failed, I noticed. Someday, it'll pass. Mm -hmm. We've got some luck this run with that. We've had some unluck. Well, it's okay. The main problem is this one's a bad one to get unluck on. Because, good lord. This is just such a slow one. Yeah, if I can get, you know, a fully elected legislature, parliamentary supremacy, it'll also get rid of, like, our semi dictatorial transfer of power, which will kind of help me move things around when the times are right. You know? Alright, stable bases. Alright. That's actually kind of the next thing I need to consider. Yeah, our, uh, unfortunately our military tech is laughably far behind. But, there you go. Actually, that's not too bad. Then the only thing left is small arms. That's the only thing we are short on. That's pretty good. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. So yeah, I've kind of got the military sorted, and then we're probably going to need military shipyarding. So I'm just assuming here you are. You really are a customs union. You're still a client state, though, unfortunately. Of course, I can't really declare war right now. I should have gone for war rights sooner. I don't know. I'm not too worried, because while we may have a lot of democratic people right now, that will change in time. Mm -hmm. There will eventually be uh, an autocratic person. I might even be able to influence that once I, uh, you know, get multiculturalism. But generally, it's pretty good. Because then I can use agitators. Cores. Oh no, only 25k, good. It's not as bad as I thought. Alright, 8 million, nice. Mm. Yeah, nice high and standard of living. Man, the turmoil is bad though. Where do all of our radicals come from? From low government strength. Wow. Yeah, back. So we just gotta deal with that, I guess. I mean, eventually we'll get there. Alright. 
Yeah, both grades. I'm trying to make sure. Let's go. We're gonna build them ourselves. Kind of leaning towards a bit of liberalization, though, of my economy. Because now I'm kind of concerned how powerful the lower classes are. Am I better to move from uh, state capitalism to interventionism? You know? Wow. Yeah, that'd be uh, actually potentially very good. Damn. 50% pri private construction allocation to 25%. I mean, that's fine. I definitely have enough construction to not really sweat about it. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Might be okay. Economic liberalization is in the cards now. Although, the cards are kind of a mess. Oh well, some days it'd be like that. The Montreal Protocol. Well, you know. Sometimes, you just gotta make some holes in the ozone. Our economy just became more competitive compared to everyone else's who just signed that, so... Unless they have even, uh, stronger regulations already. Yeah, no, we're kind of an asshole. I, I am definitely very heavy on the industry. No pollution controls. No pollution controls. Nobody fucking signed that. That's what I thought. The hole in the ozone will now kill us all. It definitely should. <laughs> oh, Lord. Alright, come on, elected legislature. Hey, look at that. Alright, stable government 75, baby. Alright, can I... Please get rid of constitutional supremacy? Like, what's blocking me? Ugh, not enough in the Senate. Not enough in the fucking Senate. What the f*** in the Senate? Eh. Like, theoretically, this fractitious government might be able to... No, that actually had less in the Senate. Alright. Hmm. Alright, so uh, the answer is this is still the best I can do. Alright. Unfortunately, changing all that is going to... You know what? I think it's time for goddamn executive order. Or something. Oh, also, we need high cap. Oh, I need a state of emergency. Okay, if I just declare a state of emergency, that would do it. That'll... Again... What? Why are you... How did you get... Nah, I have no idea. I don't know, and you know what? I don't care. 
We need to do the whole state of emergency shtick, I think. Because I am tired of this motherfucking constitution standing in my way. Unconstitutional state of emergency. Yeah, no shit. That's because the constitution is the emergency. That's not cabinet unity. Um, yeah. No, that's fine. Why can I not? What do you mean our cabinet unity is not high? The fuck? Why did you ever even become our president? I think I'm actually going to have to reload. <laughs> to before I did uh, all that, unfortunately. Because, yeah. That just broke everything. Oh well. Thank you everyone for watching. I've been your earlier Skeleton. I'll see you guys next time. Take care, folks. Have a good night.